smooth jazz saxophone. Today's episode is all about inflection and expression. How to get that quintessential smooth jazz saxophone sound. Now some people have come close and others just have no clue. So what exactly do you have to do to create that great smooth jazz sound? Well, I'm going to show you a nice, easy five-step process using only the G major pentatonic scale, which coincidentally enough is the only scale that you ever need to know to play smooth jazz. All right, the first step is making sure you have the correct equipment, just like we talked about in episode one. Looks like a soprano sax to me. Now for step two, we're actually gonna play the scale on the instrument, but instead of just playing each note really boring, we're actually gonna put a forte piano with a crescendo on every single note, just like this. Now that we have the dynamics out of the way, let's talk about vibrato. Vibrato in smooth jazz is great because you don't have to worry about intonation. You could just go flat and sharp whenever you want. For step four, we're going to talk about grace notes. There's no point in really practicing to play things really clean when you can just add little notes before and after every single note. For step five, and this is my favorite, we're going to add turns to those grace notes. So you never really know what kind of notes I'm playing or what rhythms I'm playing, but all you know is it's smooth. Bonus tip, close your eyes and lean back so no matter how dull and boring your playing is, people will still love it. Once you've applied these five easy steps to your own playing, you're going to be on your way to having that great smooth jazz sound and also on your way to sounding like the master. See you next week for episode four of How to Play Smooth Jazz Saxophone.